hello namaste friends welcome to my channel today we are going to see the resistance of the coolant temperature sensor and we know it very well we use a thermistor as a coolant temperature sensor in automobile field and if you want to know more about the coolant temperature sensor you can watch my previous video and in this video i am going to show you the resistance of the coolant temperature sensor and if you are watching my video for the first time don't forget to like comment and share video and hey don't forget to subscribe my channel and you can see this is the single wire uh, sensor it has a one wire which is supply and the signal wire and you can see on your screen uh, here inside the, the variable resistance thermistor is given and uh, it will take uh, earthing from this uh, thread which is connected on the engine so now without doing let let me start to measure the resistance of this coolant temperature sensor and i have told you before this is the single wire sensor so to make a proper connection between this sensor and the uh, multimeter i have to connect another wire so i am going to connect this wire on its thread where it is where this sensor is getting earthing from the body so so that let me connect it first it's ready now uh, let me check the connection yeah it's good the connection should be proper and uh, tight on this thread so this is ready now now i need the multimeter let me bring the multimeter where is it yeah it's here yeah this is in uh, off position now i'm going to keep it on connectivity position you can see on your screen yes here we can check the resistance and connectivity of the wire okay so let me start to connect the multimeter to the sensor wire so I am going to connect the black wire of the multimeter to the earthing of the sensor so yeah now it's ok ok now make sure uh, your connection is proper ok so here you can see the proper connection yeah this is the red wire of multimeter and the signal wire or uh, voltage wire of the uh, coolant temperature sensor let me connect it uh, it's li it's little bit difficult yeah yeah it's coming yeah you can see here multimeter is showing okay now it is showing 1.933 uh, kilo ohm resistance so uh, it means it has a 1933 uh, ohm resistance of this uh, coolant temperature sensor at the room temperature this is hot water now we are going to see how the resistance of this coolant temperature sensor will change its resistance after comes in contact with hot water so we are going to put this temperature sensor inside the hot water and we will see how the resistance of this uh, thermistor will change its resistance okay let me connect it first wait my friends keep watching my video uh, you will get yeah it's, it's showing now 2.089 uh, kilo ohm resistance now I'm going to put uh, this temperature sensor inside the hot water so let me put it inside okay now you can see the resistance of this temperature sensor decreases very fast this sensor is very sensitive my friends very sensitive you see it it becomes now 745 41 36 ohm resistance after comes in the contact with the hot water it decreases gradually very fast oh my god very good one now let me let me remove it okay wait my friends let me remove it now it uh, let me remove it out now you see after uh, removing out from the contact of the hot water the resistance of this coolant temperature sensor or thermistor you can say it is increasing now you can see it here let me put it again okay inside the hot water yeah it is decreasing now this is the basic working principle of thermistor you may understand now my friends let me remove it out now it is decreasing okay on contact with hot water now out of contact of hot water it is start to increase now very sensitive sensor this one is so now from here we can see the uh, we can say that the resistance of the thermistor or coolant temperature sensor is inversely proportional to the temperature of the coolant it means if the coolant temperature will increases the resistance of the sensor will decreases 
and if the coolant temperature will decreases the resistance of coolant temperature sensor will increases this is the basic working principle of ntc type temperature sensor hope you guys are clear about this coolant temperature sensor and if you want me to make more this kind of video please like comment and share my video and don't forget to subscribe my channel keep watching my videos thanks for watching have a good day